Hi everyone, this is Gita and I am back here in the Barkman back room and we are cooking up something fun for Fall Fest. I thought I would show you guys how to make one of my favorite recipes, which is a recipe for pumpkin spice play-doh. Mm. This smells really good. I have tried tasting it before. It is not tasty. So good to play with, not too tasty to eat. So what you're going to do, super simple, we're gonna get all our dry ingredients here together in the same bowl and just to double check here, you're gonna do one cup of flour, a half a cup of salt, that's a whole bunch of salt, but trust me, that's what the recipe needs, and two tablespoons of cream of tartar. Cream of tartar is gonna look something like this. And then our magical special ingredient, pumpkin pie spice, you will need one teaspoon, only one teaspoon. It goes a long way into making this smell really tasty. So you're gonna get all your dry ingredients together, then you'll get your wet ingredients together. I have them right here in this wonderful cup. And that'll be a tablespoon of oil, a full cup of boiling water, and you might need a little bit of parental help for this. That's okay, I just use some really warm water too. That might work out okay. And then some food coloring, and what I used was some gel food coloring. It comes in a little container like this and a little bit goes a long way. You could color this any color you wanted. If you wanted green, cool, green pumpkin pie spice Play-Doh, or purple, or blue. I just did some orange here. So it looks like pumpkin pie spice filling. So I'm gonna go ahead and mix this all together, and I will see you in a couple of seconds with our finished product. All right, guys. I have mixed up our wonderful concoction here and it smells heavenly. Pumpkin pie spice is the secret ingredient to every tasty Thanksgiving pie out there. But do not eat this, very not tasty. Also at this point you'll see it's kind of like a batter almost. It's not really pulling together like Play-Doh does. And that's just because right now our water is super warm and it's keeping everything kind of liquefied and a little bit funny looking. So give it a few minutes here, let it cool down, and then after that it'll start to pull together like a really fun pumpkin pie Play-Doh mix. So we'll see you in just a few seconds when that's all cooled off. Okay guys, we're back. We have let this cool just a little bit. It is still a little bit kind of sticky because it's not quite cool yet. I'm very impatient because this is super fun to play with. But we've got our mixture here in the bowl. If you'd like it a darker orange, go ahead. If you'd like more pumpkin pie spice so it smells extra spicy, go ahead and put some of that in, whatever you would need. So long as you keep the base recipe of that flour, water, and oil, and cream of tartar all the same, the extra stuff that you add in, such as our yummy pie spice here, or coloring, you can do as you'd like. So. We've got some wonderful Play-Doh here, and I hope you have a lot of fun with this. This is one of my favorite recipes, and you could technically use this to make a bunch of other different Play-Doh recipes, um, just making sure that your add-ins, which are your pumpkin spice, and your color are a little bit different if you'd like. Wonderful, I hope you guys have fun, and thank you for joining me for today's day of the Barkman Fall Fest.